Warning. This video is for educational purposes only. Always call a licensed contractor to perform any work. We have nest error code. Your thermostat has detected a problem with the Y1 wire. Learn more. Usually this happens when there is a short on a YY wire. It's a wire that goes to your outdoor unit condenser. Make sure you unplug the furnace. This is our outdoor unit. Make sure you turn it off. Then you need to open. This is the wire that's coming in. It's a low voltage wire. So you want to make sure that it's not shorting anywhere. This wire is inside the conduit, so it's unlikely it's going to get shorted. So most likely the short is in our contactor. So these are 24 volt contactor terminals. So we can pull the wires off and we can take our meter, put it in resistance and usually our contactor resistance, coil resistance is over 10 or 12 ohms and we only read in 0.6. So this contactor is shorted. So let me show you, for example, if we get the new contactor and we measure new contactor coil resistance will get 12.8 ohms resistance of the coil so if you get anything below 10 this means that coil inside this contactor is shorted new contactor in place and here's a click equipment detected continue continue done that's it Yay! Yes! Yes! It's very common with grind, carrier, paint, band, night, temp star, pile units. We've replaced contactor, might as well check capacitor. Again, don't forget to unplug it. We put our meter in MFZ, microfarads, and we're gonna measure our capacitor between common and Herm. This one is 45 plus 5, so we should read close to 45. It should not be more than 10% off, so it's below 40, it's bad. We read in 44, so compressor side is good. And then we'll measure between common and fan. Again, it's 45.5 capacitor, so we should read 5, not uh, within 10%, so 4.5 would be bad. We're reading 4.9, so this capacitor is good. So we'll put back herm and fan terminals on a capacitor. This capacitor looks great.